Are you prepared for life's unexpected curveballs? When crises hit and store shelves go empty, having a well-stocked pantry is essential. Today, we'll reveal the top foods experts recommend for emergency preparedness. Let's dive into the first item on this secret list, honey. Honey might seem like a simple treat, but trust me, it's a powerhouse when it comes to emergency preparedness. I remember the time I got a nasty burn while camping. Slap some honey on it, and let me tell you, it soothed the pain and helped it heal much faster. Turns out, honey has natural antibacterial and antifungal properties, making it a great natural healer. Imagine not having access to proper medical supplies in an emergency. Honey can be a lifesaver. But honey's benefits go far beyond wound care. This sticky stuff is a natural energy booster. Packed with carbohydrates like glucose and fructose, it gives your body a quick and easy source of fuel. Think of it as nature's energy bar, perfect for those times when you need a pick-me-up during stressful situations or high physical activity. And let's not forget that honey can also soothe a sore throat or a cough. Those times when you can't quite shake a cold, a spoonful of honey can work wonders. It's a natural remedy you can count on, even when access to medicine is limited. Here's the kicker, honey lasts practically forever. Stored properly in a cool, dry place in a tightly sealed container, it can be your reliable food source during extended emergencies. Just make sure to choose raw, unprocessed honey to get the most out of its natural enzymes and antioxidants. Let's move on to the next secret weapon in our emergency food arsenal, chia seeds. These tiny little guys might not look like much, but don't let their size fool you. They're packed with a nutritional punch that makes them a must-have for any prepper's pantry. My Aunt Martha used to make her famous chia pudding recipe. There was a reason it was so darn good. Chia seeds are loaded with omega-3 fatty acids, the same kind of healthy fats found in salmon. These fats are great for your heart, especially during times of stress when your body might need a little extra support. They also help reduce inflammation, which can be a real pain when your body's dealing with unexpected situations. Speaking of pain, let's talk about another benefit of chia seeds, fiber. They're a fantastic source of dietary fiber, which keeps your digestion humming along smoothly. This is especially important during emergencies when food options might be limited and you don't want any unpleasant surprises. Plus, that fiber keeps you feeling full for longer, so you can make the most of every bite when supplies are scarce. But wait, there's more. Chia seeds have this super cool superpower. They can absorb up to 12 times their weight in water. That's right, they turn into a gel-like substance. This is awesome for two reasons. First, it helps you stay hydrated, which is crucial during any emergency. Second, that gel can be used to create surprisingly filling and nutritious meals with minimal ingredients. Think chia pudding like Aunt Martha's. Chia seed eggs, perfect for vegans, or even adding them to soups and stews to thicken them up. Versatility is key when you're facing the unknown. Here's the best part. Chia seeds are like tiny nutritional time capsules. When stored in a cool, dry place, they have an incredibly long shelf life. This means you can have peace of mind knowing you have a reliable source of protein and essential nutrients in your pantry, ready to go whenever you need them. They're a complete protein source, containing all nine essential amino acids your body needs to repair muscles and stay healthy during long-term emergencies. Let's talk about something that saved my sanity during that week-long power outage last summer freeze-dried meals. Now I know what you're thinking. Emergency food? Doesn't that mean bland, tasteless mush? Not anymore. Freeze-dried meals have come a long way, and they're a lifesaver when it comes to emergency preparedness. Imagine a situation where the grocery stores are empty and you haven't had a hot meal in days. Sounds pretty grim, right? Well, freeze-dried meals can turn that frown upside down. These aren't your grandpa's dehydrated rations. These are delicious, nutritious meals that retain most of their original flavor and texture thanks to a fancy process called freeze-drying. Think of it like this. You take fresh food, flash freeze it, then gently remove all the moisture while it's still frozen. This magic trick preserves the structure and nutrients of the food, resulting in meals that can last for years, yes, years, when stored properly. That's peace of mind you can eat. But the best part isn't just the long shelf life. Freeze-dried meals are incredibly convenient. There was this camping trip where I forgot half the supplies. Don't judge, it happens to the best of us. Thankfully, I had a few freeze-dried meals with me. All I needed was some water, and voila, instant dinner with minimal fuss. They're lightweight and compact, so they won't weigh down your emergency kit or bug-out bag. Perfect for those situations where space is a precious commodity. Here's another bonus. Unlike some dehydrated foods, freeze-dried meals are packed with nutrients. The freeze-drying process doesn't destroy essential vitamins and minerals, so you can be sure you're getting a balanced diet even during emergencies. And let's not forget convenience. Just add water, 
stir, and enjoy a hot meal in minutes. No fancy cooking skills required. During stressful times, a little normalcy and a hot meal can go a long way in boosting morale. Imagine gathering around a warm fire with your family, sharing a delicious meal even when the world seems a little chaotic. Freeze-dried meals can help create those moments of comfort. Now, before you head out and buy every freeze-dried meal under the sun, here's a quick tip. Pay attention to the packaging. Look for meals in durable, airtight containers that will keep out moisture and pests. Store them in a cool, dry place for maximum shelf life. Trust me, a little planning now will ensure you have delicious and nutritious meals at your fingertips when you need them most. Now, I know canned goods might not seem glamorous, but trust me, they're the workhorses of any emergency stockpile. They're reliable, affordable, and most importantly, they pack a powerful punch of nutrition. Here's the beauty of canned food. It's shelf-stable. The canning process involves heating food to a high temperature and sealing it in an airtight container. This kills any harmful bacteria and prevents spoilage, giving you a safe and reliable food source that can last for years if stored properly. No fancy freezers or complicated storage methods needed. Just a simple can on your shelf, ready for whenever you need it. But canned food isn't just about convenience. Many canned options are packed with essential nutrients. Think vegetables like beans, peas, and corns. These guys are loaded with vitamins, minerals, and fiber, all crucial for maintaining good health, especially during emergencies when access to fresh produce might be limited. Canned fruits can also be a great way to get your daily dose of vitamins and add a touch of sweetness to your meals. Just be mindful of added sugars in some canned fruits, and opt for options in water or natural juices whenever possible. Don't forget about protein. Canned fish like tuna, salmon, and sardines are fantastic sources of lean protein, omega-3 fatty acids, and essential vitamins. They're a great way to keep your body fueled and your mind sharp during stressful situations. Plus, they're incredibly versatile. Think tuna salad sandwiches, salmon patties, or even adding them to soups and stews for an extra protein boost. Now, let's address the elephant in the room. Taste. Let's be honest, some canned food can be a bit, well, bland. But here's the secret. A little creativity goes a long way. With some spices and herbs on hand, you can transform a basic can of beans into a flavorful and satisfying dish. Think of canned food as a blank canvas for your culinary masterpieces. The internet is full of amazing recipes that use canned goods as the base, so get creative and have some fun with it. Here's a final tip for canned foods. When stocking up on canned food, pay attention to the best buy date. While canned food has a long shelf life, it's always best to rotate your stock. Use the older cans first and keep the newer ones for later. That way you can be sure you're always consuming food that's at its peak quality. Rice is more than just a side dish, folks. It's a nutritional powerhouse that deserves a place of honor in your emergency stockpile. Think about it. Rice is a whole grain, meaning it contains all the essential parts of the grain kernel, the bran, germ, and endosperm. This translates to a good dose of fiber, vitamins, and minerals, keeping you energized and healthy. Plus, it's a fantastic source of carbohydrates, which are your body's primary source of fuel. During emergencies, having a reliable source of energy is crucial, and rice delivers in spades. Want another reason to love rice? It's incredibly versatile. You can boil it, steam it, fry it, the possibilities are endless. Add some vegetables, protein, and spices, and you've got a complete and satisfying meal in minutes. Think fried rice with scrambled eggs and frozen veggies, or a simple rice and bean dish. The simplicity makes it perfect for emergency situations when you might not have access to a lot of ingredients or fancy cooking equipment. Beans might not look like much, but they're a nutritional powerhouse that deserves a permanent spot in your emergency pantry. I remember that time when I was a broke college student living on ramen noodles. Well, let's just say I learned to love the versatility and affordability of dry beans. They're a fantastic source of protein and fiber, keeping you full and energized for longer. Perfect for a hungry student on a tight budget, and perfect for anyone facing an emergency where food resources might be limited. Dry beans are like tiny nutritional time capsules. They're incredibly shelf-stable, lasting for years when stored properly in a cool, dry place. This means you can have a reliable source of protein and essential nutrients on hand, ready for whenever you need them. Plus, they're incredibly affordable. You can buy a whole bag of beans for a fraction of the price of some other protein sources. Stretch your dollar further and stock your pantry with these little nutritional powerhouses. Beyond affordability and shelf life, dry beans are packed with health benefits. They're an excellent source of plant-based protein, crucial for building and repairing muscles. They're also loaded with fiber, which keeps your digestive system humming along smoothly and helps you feel full for longer. 
This is especially important during emergencies when food might be scarce. And let's not forget vitamins and minerals. Dry beans are a good source of iron, folate, and potassium, all essential for maintaining good health. Now, some folks might be intimidated by dry beans because of the soaking and cooking time. But here's the good news. There are ways around it. While soaking overnight is traditional, you can use a quick soak method that takes just an hour or two. There are also pressure cooker methods that can cook beans in even less time. And hey, if all else fails, canned beans are a perfectly acceptable alternative. Here's the fun part. Dry beans are incredibly versatile. Think chili, soups, stews, dips, and even veggie burgers. The internet is full of amazing recipes that showcase the many ways to incorporate dry beans into your meals. With a little creativity, you can turn these humble legumes into delicious and nutritious dishes, even during emergencies. Let's talk about dehydrated foods. Now I know what you're thinking. Isn't that just another word for boring camping food? Not quite. Dehydrated foods have come a long way, and they offer a convenient and lightweight solution for emergency preparedness. Dehydration is a process of removing moisture from food. This not only reduces its weight and size, but also extends its shelf life significantly. Dehydrated foods can last for months, even years when stored properly in airtight containers. This makes them a great option for emergency kits and bug-out bags, where space and weight are at a premium. But don't be fooled by the light packaging. Dehydrated foods can be surprisingly nutritious. Many options retain a significant amount of their original vitamins and minerals during the dehydration process. Plus, they come in a wide variety of options, from fruits and vegetables to complete meals with protein, vegetables, and grains. This ensures you have access to a balanced diet even during emergencies. And let's talk about convenience. Rehydrating dehydrated foods is a breeze. Most just require adding hot water and waiting a few minutes. No fancy cooking skills or equipment needed. Perfect for those times when resources might be limited or when you just need a quick and easy meal. Here's a health tip for you. When buying dehydrated foods, pay attention to the sodium content. Some options can be quite high in sodium, so opt for lower sodium varieties whenever possible. You can also add your own spices and herbs to dehydrated meals to boost their flavor and personalize them to your taste. Let's talk about a pantry staple that can be surprisingly versatile in an emergency. Flour. Now I know flour might not seem like the most exciting food on its own, but trust me, it's a powerful base for creating a variety of nutritious meals. Flour is extremely shelf-stable. Stored properly in a cool, dry place in an airtight container, flour can last for months, even years. This means you have a dependable base for baking and cooking on hand, ready for whenever you need it. But flour's power goes beyond shelf life. It's incredibly versatile. Think pancakes, bread, biscuits, pasta dough. The possibilities are endless. With a little flour, some water, and maybe a few other basic ingredients, you can create a variety of meals that are both satisfying and nutritious. This is especially important during emergencies, when access to pre-made foods might be limited. Now let's address the elephant in the room. Not all flowers are created equal. For emergency preparedness, I recommend having a variety on hand. Whole wheat flour is a great option, as it contains more fiber and nutrients than white flour. All-purpose flour is a good all-around choice, perfect for a variety of recipes. You might also consider gluten-free flours like almond flour or coconut flour for those with dietary restrictions. Here's a tip. Don't just rely on store-bought bread during emergencies. With flour on hand, you can bake your own fresh bread. The smell alone can boost morale. The internet is full of simple recipes for homemade bread that require minimal ingredients and effort. Embrace your inner baker and create delicious and comforting meals for yourself and your family. Now I know sugar gets a bad rap these days, and for a good reason. But hear me out, sugar can actually play a valuable role in emergency preparedness. There was this time when I was on a long hike and hit a major energy slump. A few spoonfuls of sugar did wonders for giving me a quick and much needed boost. Sugar can be a lifesaver in situations where energy levels are crucial. Sugar is a simple carbohydrate, meaning your body can break it down quickly for energy. During emergencies, maintaining your energy levels is important, and sugar can provide a temporary boost when you need it most. Think of it as a quick pick-me-up during stressful situations or when physical activity is required. Now, before you start picturing bags of candy in your emergency stockpile, here's the key. Moderation is crucial. Sugar shouldn't be your main source of energy, but it can be a helpful tool in your preparedness arsenal. Opt for natural sugars like honey or maple syrup whenever possible, as they offer additional nutrients compared to refined white sugar. 
But sugar's benefits go beyond just energy. It can also be used for preserving food. Think jams, jellies, and homemade fruit preserves. These can be a great way to add some sweetness and variety to your emergency meals. And they can also help extend the shelf life of fruits. Here's a tip. When choosing sugar for your emergency stockpile, consider brown sugar as well. Brown sugar retains some of the molasses from the sugar cane, giving it a richer flavor and a touch of moisture, which can be helpful in baking. All right, folks, let's talk about a golden oldie of emergency preparedness, cornmeal. This might seem like a one-trick pony for cornbread, but trust me, cornmeal is a surprisingly versatile addition to your emergency pantry. Cornmeal is surprisingly versatile. Think cornbread, tortillas, polenta. The possibilities are endless. With a little cornmeal, some water, and maybe a few other basic ingredients, you can create a variety of meals that are both satisfying and nutritious. This is especially important during emergencies, when access to pre-made foods might be limited. Now let's talk about the benefits of cornmeal. It's a good source of carbohydrates, which are your body's primary source of energy. During emergencies, having a reliable source of energy is crucial, and cornmeal can help keep you going. It's also a good source of fiber, which aids in digestion and keeps you feeling full for longer. Here's a tip. Don't just rely on cornbread. Explore the world of polenta. This creamy Italian dish is made from cornmeal and can be enjoyed in many ways. Add some cheese and herbs for a comforting side dish, or top it with your favorite vegetables for a complete meal. Nuts might seem unassuming, but they're packed with a nutritional punch that makes them a perfect addition to your emergency food stockpile. Here's the deal. Nuts are shelf-stable. Stored in a cool, dry place in an airtight container, most nuts can last for months, even years. This means you have a reliable source of protein, healthy fats, and essential nutrients on hand, ready for whenever you need them. They're perfect for tossing in your emergency kit or bug-out bag for a quick and healthy snack on the go. But the benefits of nuts go beyond shelf life. They're a fantastic source of healthy fats, which are essential for maintaining good heart health and brain function. They're also a good source of protein, crucial for building and repairing muscles. And let's not forget fiber. Nuts keep your digestive system humming along smoothly and help you feel full for longer. This is especially important during emergencies when food intake might be limited. Now let's talk about variety. There's a whole world of nuts out there, each with its own unique flavor and nutritional profile. Almonds, cashews, walnuts, peanuts, the options are endless. Mix and match your favorites or choose a variety pack for a well-rounded dose of nutrients. Here's a tip. While nuts are a fantastic snack on their own, you can also incorporate them into your meals. Add chopped nuts to salads, yogurt, or even oatmeal for an extra crunch of protein and healthy fats. They can also be used as breading or topping for meats and vegetables. Moving on, let's talk about a classic emergency food, jerky. Now I know jerky might conjure up images of tough, flavorless gas station snacks, but trust me, jerky has come a long way, and it's a fantastic option for keeping your protein levels up during emergencies. Jerky is a fantastic source of protein, essential for building and repairing muscles. During emergencies, maintaining your energy levels is crucial, and jerky provides a convenient and concentrated dose of protein to keep you going. Plus, it's lightweight and compact, making it easy to pack and carry with you. Now let's talk about flavor. Gone are the days of bland, tasteless jerky. Today you can find jerky in a wide variety of flavors, from classic beef to teriyaki chicken to spicy turkey. There's something for everyone. This makes jerky not just a source of sustenance, but also a satisfying snack that can boost morale during stressful situations. Now I know salt gets a bad rap these days, and for good reason. But hear me out. Salt plays a crucial role in our bodies and can be an essential part of your emergency preparedness plan. Salt is a mineral that helps regulate fluids in your body. During emergencies, especially in hot weather or during physical activity, maintaining proper hydration is essential. Salt helps your body retain fluids, preventing dehydration and keeping you feeling your best. This is especially important when access to clean water might be limited. Now, before you start picturing yourself chugging straight salt, here's the key. Moderation is crucial. You don't need a ton of salt to reap its benefits. A little bit goes a long way in helping your body function properly. Many emergency foods already contain some salt, but having a small container on hand allows you to adjust seasoning to your needs. Beyond its role in hydration, salt can also be used for food preservation. Think of pickling vegetables or curing meats. These traditional methods rely on salt to prevent spoilage and extend the shelf life of food. 
Now, I know fresh milk is a staple in most kitchens, but during emergencies, access to fresh dairy products might be limited. That's where evaporated milk comes in, a shelf-stable alternative that packs a powerful nutritional punch. Unlike regular milk that needs refrigeration, evaporated milk undergoes a special process that removes about half of the water content. This heating process also kills bacteria, allowing the milk to be stored for months, even a year without refrigeration, as long as the container remains unopened. This makes it a perfect addition to your emergency pantry, ensuring you have a reliable source of milk even when the power goes out or fresh options are unavailable. But shelf life isn't the only benefit of evaporated milk. It's surprisingly nutritious. Evaporated milk retains most of the essential nutrients found in regular milk, including calcium, protein, and vitamin D. These nutrients are crucial for maintaining strong bones, healthy muscles, and overall bodily functions. During emergencies, having a reliable source of these essential nutrients is vital for staying healthy and strong. And let's talk about versatility. Evaporated milk can be used in pretty much the same way as regular milk. Think cereal, coffee, tea. The possibilities are endless. You can even use it in baking and cooking. Add it to soups, sauces, and baked goods for a creamy texture and a boost of flavor. This versatility ensures you can still prepare a variety of meals and maintain a sense of normalcy even in a crisis situation. Powdered milk is just what it sounds like, regular milk that's been dehydrated into a powdered form. This process removes most of the moisture, making it incredibly lightweight and compact, perfect for emergency kits and bug out bags where space is at a premium. Plus, it's shelf stable, lasting for months, even years when stored properly in a cool, dry place. This ensures you have a reliable source of calcium and other essential nutrients even during emergencies. When buying powdered milk, there are two main options, whole milk powder and non-fat dry milk. Whole milk powder will provide a richer flavor and more calories, while non-fat dry milk is a lower calorie option. Choose the one that best suits your needs and preferences. I know peanut butter is a beloved classic, but powdered peanut butter takes things to a whole new level of convenience and emergency preparedness. Unlike regular peanut butter that requires refrigeration after opening, powdered peanut butter is shelf-stable, lasting for months, even years, when stored properly in a cool, dry place. This makes it a perfect addition to your emergency kit or bug-out bag, as it requires no refrigeration and is ready to eat whenever you need it. Plus, it's incredibly lightweight and compact, taking up much less space than a jar of regular peanut butter. And powdered peanut butter provides a convenient and concentrated dose of protein to keep you going. It's also a good source of healthy fats, keeping you feeling full for longer. When buying powdered peanut butter, consider options with added sugar for a quick energy boost or choose unsweetened varieties for more control over sweetness. Also, make sure to check for any peanut allergies before adding powdered peanut butter to your stockpile. I know oatmeal might seem like a simple breakfast option, but trust me, it's a nutritional powerhouse that's perfect for storing in your emergency pantry. Oatmeals are packed with fiber, which keeps your digestive system humming along smoothly and helps you feel full for longer. This is especially important during emergencies when food intake might be limited. Oatmeal is also a good source of complex carbohydrates, which provides sustained energy throughout the day. And let's talk about versatility. Oatmeal is a blank canvas of breakfast possibilities. Think classic with just a sprinkle of cinnamon and sugar, or go all out with nuts, seeds, dried fruits, and a drizzle of honey. You can even add cooked vegetables or a dollop of peanut butter for a more savory option. This versatility ensures you can enjoy a delicious and satisfying breakfast even during emergencies. Here's a tip. While instant oatmeal is convenient, consider stocking up on rolled oats as well. They offer a bit more texture and can be used in other ways beyond breakfast, like baking cookies or energy bars. All right, folks, let's talk about a tiny but mighty food perfect for emergency preparedness, lentils. Now, I know lentils might not seem exciting, but trust me, they're a nutritional powerhouse packed with benefits. Dry lentils can last for months, even years, when stored properly in a cool, dry place in airtight containers. This means you have a reliable source of protein and fiber on hand, ready for whenever you need it. Plus, they're incredibly budget-friendly, stretching your dollar further during emergencies. They're also packed with protein, essential for building and repairing muscles. During emergencies, maintaining your energy levels is crucial, and lentils provide a plant-based source of protein to keep you going. They're also a fantastic source of fiber, which keeps your digestive system humming along smoothly and helps you feel full for longer. This is especially important when food intake might be limited. Lentils can be enjoyed in so many ways. 
Think hearty lentil soups and stews, or add them to salads for a protein boost. They can even be used to make vegetarian burgers or meatloaf. This versatility ensures you can create a variety of delicious and satisfying meals even during emergencies. Unlike many other oils, coconut oil remains stable for up to two years without refrigeration, as long as it's stored in a cool, dark place. This makes it an ideal long-term food storage option, perfect for emergency kits and bug-out bags. But coconut oil's power goes beyond shelf life. One of its biggest advantages is its high smoke point. This means you can use it for frying, sautéing, and baking without it breaking down and releasing harmful compounds. This makes it a safe and stable cooking oil especially in situations where cooking resources might be limited. Beyond its culinary uses, coconut oil is packed with health benefits. It contains medium-chain triglycerides, or MCTs, a type of fat that your body can quickly convert into energy. This makes it a quick energy source, beneficial during emergencies when maintaining energy levels is crucial. MCTs are also known to support cognitive function and metabolism, contributing to overall well-being during stressful times. Coconut oil's uses extend beyond the kitchen. Its antibacterial, antifungal, and antiviral properties make it useful for various non-food applications. You can apply it topically to treat minor wounds, prevent infections, and soothe skin irritations. In situations where medical supplies are scarce, coconut oil can serve as a natural remedy for a range of skin conditions and minor injuries. Let's move on to a convenient and portable powerhouse for your emergency stockpile, protein bars. These bars are packed with protein, essential for maintaining muscle mass and overall health, especially during times of stress and limited food availability. Protein plays a crucial role in various bodily functions, including muscle repair, immune response, and energy production. When traditional protein sources like meat or dairy become scarce, protein bars offer a reliable alternative. Protein bars are individually packaged, lightweight, and require no preparation. This makes them perfect for emergency kits, bug-out bags, and on-the-go consumption. You can have a quick and nutritious meal or snack whenever needed, without the hassle of cooking or preparing anything. Here's another benefit, variety. Protein bars come in a wide range of flavors and formulations to cater to different dietary needs and preferences. Some bars offer a balanced mix of protein, carbohydrates, and fats, while others focus on low sugar or high fiber content. This variety ensures you can choose options that best suit your nutritional requirements and taste buds, making sure you have enjoyable and satisfying food choices during a crisis. When selecting protein bars for your emergency stockpile, consider factors like ingredient quality, nutritional content, and potential allergens. Opt for bars with minimal artificial additives and a balanced nutrient profile to ensure you're getting the best possible sustenance. But food isn't the only thing you need to worry about when it comes to preparing for a disaster. Click the video on screen now to find out more about the 17 items you can't be without in a disaster.